Hi friends, this is Pradeep Kumar Singh here and again I am on the behalf of Indian State of India. I am going to discuss the problems on the process calculation, uh, the question which have come on the gate 2016. Okay? Now, the process calculation uh, question in the gate examination is based on the energy balance. Now, the first question I am just going to discuss is, which is based on the energy balance, is question number 31. Now, the, this is a simple question, you can see, a jacket steel tank, a tank is there, where some jacket are <coughs> provided in order to extract the amount of heat that has generated because of mixing, okay. Now, this is the, uh, this jacket is provided for the removal of heat, okay. Here, two streams are going to add, the first stream is water, okay, which is coming <coughs> in the rate, which is coming in, in the tank, at the rate of 6 kg per hour 6 kg per hour and the other stream is here sulfuric acid H2SO4 ok now this is coming at the rate of 4 kg per hour now but the input temperature is different this is the, at the temperature of 10 degree centigrade and this is a temperature of 25 degree centigrade ok they are just going to mix here ok now and they are coming out from the tank at the temperature, the mixture which is 40% of the solution because this is 6 kg and this is 4 kg the mixture will become of the 40% uh, sulfuric acid solution will be there ok now the mixture which is coming from the output from the tank having 40% H2O support solution here and this temperature is at the 40 degree centigrade this temperature is just you can see here uh, the temperature is you can uh, enter here 40 degrees centigrade. Okay. Now here you have to uh, find out what amount of heat that have removed in order to get the output temperature at a 40 degree centigrade. Now the simple balance. Now energy balance concept here. Applying the simple steady state energy balance because they have is given that the process is steady state. Now simple energy balance is you can see here energy in minus energy out plus some since as the two solutions are going to mix some amount of it will generate now means this is the energy generated due to mixing energy for mixing this is plus sign because some amount of energy is going to generate okay this pressure this is plus sign okay minus which some certain amount of heat you have to remove minus energy removed and no accumulation because process is steady state now first you, I have, we have to find out energy in now energy in energy is going to in by the flow now water is going to flow as the MCPDT and reference temperature the reference temperature is given as here 25 degree centigrade is the reference temperature now means energy in by the water and energy in by the sulfuric acid means we can say the mass for it this is the mass rate of the water is 6 kg per hour and Cp of the water is given as a <coughs> Cp of the water is given in your problem is 4.2 kJ per kg kg now and Mcp and rit T is the 10 degree centigrade and minus refresh temperature is 25 ok now this is energy in by the water plus energy in by sulfuric acid also this is the flow mass rate is 4 kg per hour and Cp of sulfuric acid is suppose this is not given H2SO4 now and this is again 25 and reference temperature is also 25 that's why this term will get cancelled out now if you solve you will get the simple the value like I am just writing the value is minus 378 kilojoule per hour this is the energy in by the flow now similarly second term energy out now second thing just note down this this is another energy in now second term here you can see here energy out the energy out energy out here energy is going to out by the flow now since 
the 40% sulfuric acid solution is coming out from the tank that's why and the, the specific heat capacity of the 40% solution mixture is given in the problem the CP of 40% sulfuric acid solution is given here in the problem and which is given as your 2.8 kJ per kg of solution in Kelvin now solution solution is of the 10 kg because 6 kg per hour of the water and 4 kg per hour of the sulfuric acid if you are going to add this is 10 kg per hour now it means energy out by mass flow rate of the solution mass flow rate of the solution Cp of solution okay and to T output temperature is 40 and my reference temperature is 25 now since in the here the solution is mass flow rate of solution is 6 plus 4 10 okay kg per hour Cp of solution is 2.8 kJ per kg of solution no. and reference temperature is 40 minus 25 if you solve here you will get the value like plus 420 kJ per hour okay this is the energy out by the flow now note down this term the third term is the energy is generated because of mixing now <coughs> since energy generated by the mixing is no energy for mixing and the heat of solution is given as a in the in the problem they have given the heat of solution is equal to 650 now 650 kilojoule amount of heat will generate per kg of sulfuric acid per kg of H2SO4 means for the 1 kg of H2SO4 that much amount of heat will generate okay that's why if you multiply by the amount of H2SO4 and amount of H2SO4 is 4 kg okay 4 kg of H2SO4 okay and this is per hour if you solve this is cancel out this is kg per hour and if you again solve this term this term will give the value of 2600 kJ per hour okay now if you put all these values in the generalized steady state energy balance energy in is minus 378 minus energy out is minus 420 plus that much amount of energy will generate plus sign okay here 2600 plus now minus some amount of heat will remove suppose this is q equal to 0 and if you solve you will get q is equal to 1802 kJ per hour this that much amount of heat has removed from the system in order to maintain the output temperature at 40 degree centigrade okay this is the problem based on the energy balance now <coughs> the next problem On the process calculation is here. Now just wait for uh, some minutes. is flowing as inlet stream P now this is inlet stream P and this is going to split this is Q and this is R okay now since this is splitter the concentration of uh, any component in the Q and R will be same because this is a splitter property of a splitter is there concentration is going not going to change okay now and they have given that this P contains 30 mass percent ethanol 30 mass percent, 30 percent ethanol. Okay, and is 
100 kg per hour and P is given as a 100 kg per hour and therefore what is the least number of additional specification required to find out the mass per it and the composition of the two exit stream Q and R now this is very simple you can see here since P is going to split into two streams the Q and R therefore composition of Q and R will be same now it means composition composition of ethanol in P is equal to ethanol in Q plus ethanol in R no. and P is equal to simply Q plus R okay now it means and since 100% 100 kg per hour and 30 this is given as P into 0 0.3 is equal to simply you can say Q into suppose the composition is I am just going to have the composition is again same P, Q and R the composition is not going to change P, Q into 0.3 plus R into 0.3 okay now it means simply if you are able to miss here P is known to you 100 this is 100 now here two equation is there Q and R and Q and R it means if you are able to only find out the value of one additional one term you are able to find out it means only one term is required to <coughs> one additional term will require to solve the composition as well as the fluid Q and R okay that's it thank you